have you seen different tomatoes in grocery, in the grocery store, but you weren't sure what the different names meant? Many people now realize, as you might as well, that a tomato is not really a vegetable, as we usually call it, but it's actually a fruit. Did you know that it's really a berry? The sources for my speech today are from produceoasis.com, gardeningchannel.com, and also some information from the College of Agriculture and Life Science from the University of Arizona. Today I'll be talking about Roma tomatoes, early girl tomatoes, and beefsteak tomatoes. First I'd like to talk about the Roma tomato. The color of the Roma tomato ranges from pink to yellow, orange, and even deep red. The flesh of the Roma tomato is really dense and meaty, and it doesn't have a lot of seeds in it, which makes it really ideal for creating pastes and sauces. They tend to be oblong in shape rather than round. As I said, they're really great for sauces and pastes. They're also good for canning, and they're excellent in Italian dishes. You can also eat them raw as well. You might also not have known that a Roma tomato is also called an Italian tomato or an Italian plum tomato. Next, I'd like to talk to you about the early girl tomatoes. Early girl tomatoes are meaty also, just like the Roma tomatoes. They have lots of flavor and are really aromatic. They're medium sized and round, but slightly flattened and they're bright red in color, in contrast to the Roma tomatoes that are lots of different colors. The use of the early girl tomato is for home gardening. They have a short growing season, which makes them really desirable because they can mature faster than a lot of other tomatoes. They're also good for slicing. Some additional information about this tomato is that it was a hybrid developed in the 1970s and it was voted favorite tomato in Sunset Magazine by a reader poll in 1993 and 1997. Lastly, I'd like to talk about the beefsteak tomato, which is also meaty in texture. The colors of a beefsteak tomato range from red to pale yellow and even purple black. They're also round, round like the early girl tomato, but they're flattened as well as the early girl tomato. Uses for the beefsteak tomato include slicing. They hold together really well when they slice because of their core. They're also good for eating raw, and they are really great for adding to sandwiches. Some additional information is that they have a slow maturing process. It takes them 90 days to mature, and the plant for the beefsteak tomato will keep producing until there's a frost. So in conclusion today, we've talked about the Roma, Early Girl, and Beefsteak tomatoes. Now when you go to the grocery store, you're going to have some more knowledge than you did before. You can even use this information to impress your friends.